Okay, Libra, this is going to be your February uh, general. So we're just going to pull a four-card spread, three for the week, and one for advice, and see where you guys are headed for February, coming off that freaking weird eclipse. That thing looked crazy. That thing looked like a big glowing portal in the sky. It looked like that yesterday when it was eclipsing, and it looked like that this morning. It was crazy. I don't know what energy is coming through that thing, but... Whew. All right, so what's going on for February for Libra? So the month of February. I think I need one more shuffle here, and then we'll be ready. Libra. Seen a lot of Aries in here. Some water signs you guys might be dealing with. All right. Or Taurus. Uh, Taurus is strong. Taurus was strong in you guys' love reading as well. So there's a world card here. Page of Cups. And the Ace of Swords. Yeah, this is kind of mimicking your love reading. You got the Moon card here as the advice. Um, so it's overall, it's the Six of Pentacles. This is cooperation, harmony, or... Um, so, yeah... Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So what I'm getting here, basically, all right, we got the world card here at the top here. So there's definitely an ending of a cycle. I don't want to say necessarily it's an ending because in your love relationship, um, in your in their reading there was two types of libras out there there was some that were ending a cycle for good with people like this person that they're dealing with and then there was a person who was um ending a cycle uh within a person to read to get some new beginnings i see the fool card here with the knight of cups so there's a new offer of, of love coming in um and it could be from a person you were already dealing with if you guys have um essentially like reconciled but of course, there's gonna, there's gonna be some conflicts are surrounding this reconciliation. It's not gonna be all easy. Um, I don't see this being an easy reconciliation. We've got the page of cups in the middle of the month here, so there's definitely an offer of love. Um, somebody and I get this is like somebody trying to rekindle something. Why is the page of cups here? Why is the page of cups here? Why is the page of cups here? Yep. The Justice card. So this is somebody trying to reconcile, okay? Somebody's trying to reconcile. This is also you guys here. So this could be you if we're uh, the dominant uh, energy Libras, like the men, male Libras or the dominant Libras. Um, or this could be uh, somebody coming in to try to offer reconciliation with you through love. Um, the Ace of Swords is here. So this is the truth coming out. Um, the Moon card here is the advice. So th this is a card of secrets. But I also get... Um, intuition and i feel like that eclipse is definitely going to have something to do with this truth that's coming out or somebody speaking the truth um i see some towers in this as well so yeah there could be some towers that came in and knocked some things out of place or made some people come out with the truth of energy and that's why this cycle may have ended here um but secrets is the theme of this is the advice for this month and the truth so I feel like you guys either need to brace yourselves for something that might come out um, that might cause this ending here at the beginning of February. And I also feel like you're going to definitely need to use your intuition. You may also be dealing with a Cancer or a Scorpio. Um, but I see towers here. And I see waters that are like turbulent. So there's going to be some turbulence this month, uh, especially where emotions are concerned, Libra. This is not going to be an easy uh, month for you emotionally, especially about a new beginning coming in, possibly with an Aries or a new start with somebody. Um, there's going to be a need for that. Um, and you guys may start getting cold. You know, Libras can embody the, the king of swords energy. And, and you guys were getting that from the eclipse. That's why I think I named y'all as king me. So I feel like you guys might have to step into that uh, that King of Swords energy. We've got the High Priestess here. So you guys with the with the Star card. So you guys are closed off um, to a soulmate or um, to a wish that you guys had with the soulmate. But you're closed off to the soulmate for a while here. Now eventually it ends with a new beginning here. 
with the um, fool. And it does end with the judgment and the two of cups. So somebody makes a decision as far as where a twin flame is concerned um, and a soulmate is concerned. But for a while there, there's just, there's some issues here. There's definitely going to be some new opportunities with money, though. That's a good thing I can tell you guys here. Uh, for those who like to hear about their career, there's new opportunities with money, new opportunities to collaborate. But there's some deception, guys, that's going to come out at the beginning of the month. Okay? There's some deception um, that's going to come out, and it, and it might rock your foundation a little bit. Um, the tower card didn't come out, but there were some towers in that moon card. Um, we got the six of pentacles and the five of wands. So, yeah, there's going to be conflict at the beginning of the month that might end, lead to this end of the, the, this cycle. But this, there could be reconciliation here. Now, whether you choose to keep moving with this person, I feel like you're going to. Um, I feel like a decision is going to be made um, to assess the situation. But you definitely need to use this. Okay, and yeah, this this is coming out. Okay, the page of swords. Somebody's coming with a message or communication that might rock you you emotionally. But um, yeah, other eyes. There's gonna be new opportunities for money, but you. I think emotions is gonna be a big theme for you guys this month, definitely. So um, you might need to step into that King of Swords energy, like I was telling you guys for the eclipse reading. Um, nothing wrong with that, especially you know that's a sign for you. I mean, a card for you guys. You guys are air signs, so there's nothing wrong with stepping in that King of Swords energy, Libra. Um, yeah, so I think that's really it for that all I wanted to pull for this one. So, uh, Libra, if you have any questions for me, my contact information is in the description along with all the information for a personal reading. Um, please like if you like this, comment if you resonated at all, uh, share if you want to, and subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys next time, Libra.